it is neither too complicated and too simple to create a lovely image. Even the most expensive camera can produce poor quality image if the operator lacks photographic skills. A standard camera also can produce a good quality image. The quality of the image produced is determined not by the technology of the camera but by who manage it skillfully and appropriately. Here, I gave you some useful tips and skills that everyone should know. The first and the most crucial step is to become comfortable with your own camera. Why? Is it necessary to know your camera? Yes, it is. It's like you have a sport car but you don't know how to drive them. That's how the camera works. If you don't know how to use it, everything goes wrong. Maybe your photo is out of focus, overexposed, underexposed or you try to make bokeh but it didn't work. You must understand the function of each button on your camera. So getting to know your camera first is important before moving to the next step. Second, exposure triangle. The relation between aperture, shutter speed and ISO can be highly confusing for many new photographers. However, once you understand how to make it work, uh, you will be pleased with your progress, evolution and outcomes. The three sides of the exposure triangle are aperture, shutter speed and ISO. They collaborate to create a properly exposed photograph. If one variable change, at least one of the others must change to maintain the proper exposure. Third, composition rule. The subject position is important for producing a decent image because the positioning of the subject give the impression that the image contain a story. The subject posture also has an impact on the image stability and however, it also depends on the subject and location. Okay, that's all for today. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Ciao!